Hello everyone, my name is Cliff Joseph and today I'm going to teach you one of my cardistry moves that I created a while back ago called Ripley. But first of all, uh, huge thanks for Nate for having me in into his channel, for letting me teach this move to you guys and also a quick side note, I also have a YouTube channel called Joseph Drake, will be great if you could subscribe to the channel too. Okay, with that all said, let's get into the move. Alright, so for the move, it should look like this. Boom. And then set. All right. So there you go. That's Ripley. I think that might be a little bit advanced move, but it's a cool move. It's like four packet parties trick cut. So for the tutorial, we're going to start with an elevated dealer script like so. Just a simple normal dealer script, right? And then you're going to start with Z grip which is like this if you don't know about Z grip you're going to break the first packet using your left middle finger I mean right sorry like so then using your right thumb you're going to break another packet like this so it's like Z Z grip then from here your left thumb going to reach the middle packet and then you're going to break into like so so it's four packet now and then from here you're going to drop the packet on your hand then your ring finger will come up like so to hold that corner okay and then your right middle finger will come to the other corner so it holds like so then from here, your right thumb will hold the other corner. Then you can actually release this. So the grip should look like this. I know it's a weird grip, but I think it's original. One more time. Z grip. Break the middle packet. And then drop the packet. Hold that corner. Regrip your thumb so it should look like this. Once it, sorry, once you get into here, next thing you're going to do is move the packet like so. It's actually pretty simple. You can use your wonder finger to rotate the three of cups so that, like so. Okay, one more time. From here, just rotate it like this until you go underneath your hand. Then from here, you're going to rotate the packet up again like this. So from here, you go down and then you rotate the packet up again. And once you while you go up, you're going to execute a scissor cut which is like this sorry I think it's a you know one in the cut very simple then while you're executing the scissor cut your this three of packets would go into the middle you close that scissor cut and you put that packet there so it's all holes in one again okay one more time z grip break the packet off re grip the position rotate the packet rotate again and secure scissor cut pull in close the scissor cut put the packet there and then from the from here the closing should look like this you're going to break this packet using your pointer finger boom like so and from here you're going to use your left thumb and to put the packet like here and then just rotate between your thumb until the packet falls so once again go from here 
from here going to rotate it slowly until it lines up with the deck you can just drop it then from here you can re-grip this packet with your pointer and middle finger like so okay so from here just going to release it re-grip and then you can slide this packet back and move it around your thumb let me explain it so when you slide the packet here okay sorry slide the packet here you're going to move between your thumb like this okay once you've done that you can actually just close it like so or you can actually add a chart here okay? so like this you can add a chart here. I believe as that's already taught this so let's do a quick recap break off re-grip your position turn the packet and rotate it around execute scissor cut going through the boom and place it there break another one move it around your thumb re-grip slide back boom and close and you can add a target gun if you want So that's it guys for the tutorial, I hope you guys enjoyed the move, once again thank you for Nick for letting me teach this move for you guys and I think that's it, peace.